Good evening, good afternoon, and good morning. I'm Fresh Melon, and today we're doing a small bonding of Isaac, and we're probably still going to try and do a Maggie run because <laughs> I need to get some stuff just ticked off that list, and I'm having a really bad time with it in general. Like, I know I'm not great at the game, but I feel like the game punishes me extra, even more than than just being bad at the game, you know. Like, some people probably look at me and think, yeah, that's about the uh, average Isaac play I expect from you. <laughs> Other people are probably looking like, hmm, is it really that bad? Mercury, extra speed up's fine. I could try and bomb the fires in there for spirit hearts. We got one here anyway. I should not pick that up. Should have done it afterwards, but it's fine. But that's why I should not have picked it up. But yeah, it's pretty standard for me to be terrible at a computer game. <laughs> Daddy long legs. Now, as long as I just don't take damage, this this run is one. Um, just simple as. Uh, we will get that chest. Because it should pay for itself, kind of. Nah, uh, we use a bomb here. Pretty good on the money front. Um, I will keep my money, though. So, yeah, I'm currently doing a bulk recording of just, like, random stuff as I'll be away for, like, the weekend. And it's going to be a great time. I'm going to enjoy it. Basically, camping with friends with pretty much probably no food and a bunch of crazy because someone's going to forget to bring food and that'll probably also be my fault somehow. And it's more of like a little kind of birthday get-together for myself and some friends, which is going to be nice. I'm going to enjoy it, so... It, it is, it's one of those things where uh, as you get older, you tend to find that getting people to gather is becomes more and more difficult. And it's not like, you know, um, people need to or stuff like that. It's never been much of an issue either side. It's just more of a... You know, something you should really kind of end up focusing on is, like, how many friends you have and how you keep in contact with them. I know I'm terrible at it. Even at the best times. Nah, I wasn't looking at that. Just because, like, that's just who I am. I'm kind of a loner. I like to keep to myself. It makes things easier. Don't have to worry about usual kind of expectations or stuff like that, or if I've done something right or wrong, or, you know, usual questions that you end up, uh, Oh, that's what Lucid does, like, it means uh, the doors don't close. Cool. Uh, yeah, we'll just leave this room. But... It's, n it's nice when you've got good friends, you know? Ones that generally don't care about that sort of stuff. That's what I mean, like, like I've I got friends that are idiots, and they do stupid stuff on a consistent basis, and some of them I will punch in the face the next time I see them because of those stupid things they did. Oh, I thought that would actually uh, pop that. Never mind. And they know they deserve it. Like, 100% they know they deserve it. But we're still friends with them today. Like, I have been friends with them for so long that at this point we're family. It's, it, you just can't get away from it. <laughs> you know? And then between that, then there's people that I kind of know that I get on with and, you know, we meet up every so often. It's nice, you know? I was hoping for a spirit heart in here, but we do not get it. Let's bomb this guy. I was hoping for something pretty decent, but 
Hmm. No, we'll uh, use a key on that, actually. Key for a bomb is kind of good in that trade. We get Widow. At least we have some damage this time with Synthoil. Was it Synthoil we got? No, not Synthoil. The other one. The other syringe that gives you damage, but speed as well. Dude, you're jumping so much. <laughs> I was like, that's going to keep jumping, isn't it? Consolation Prize, plus one to my lowest stat. And... Ooh. I would like to take both of these. Little Brimstone is pretty good. Do I take Little Brim? Hmm. I think we just take Little Brimstone and leave it there. Because I want to go too low on... Um, health-wise, and then we'll try and get some money. Min-max the floor as much as possible. Like, maybe we get health from this, you know? And then if the uh, floor thing is open still, we do not. I don't have regen, so I'll just use this once and then move on. I liked it originally when you could abuse the invincibility frames of stuff, you know. But yeah, I mean, it's it's something that a lot of me and my friends end up doing um, every so often, is we'll try to, like, make gatherings to when we can kind of all meet up and do stuff. Like, one of the ones we used to do was back to do meetups for New Year's, and that was always good fun. Like, because New Year's, as much as everyone wants to be around by family and everything else as well, like, me and my friends are pretty all agreed, New Year's is kind of an adult celebration, more than there's anything else. So, that's kind of what it's ended up becoming with, and, like, most of them got kids that are fairly young at the moment that don't really much know much difference as well, so, they normally end up being off to the grandparents, who absolutely love to spend time with the kids. <laughs> <laughs> they're young enough they don't really care about most of the stuff anyway and then we get to just hang together and play games and just all chill out with a bunch of alcohol which uh, is nice you know I remember half the time where it's just we hear fireworks in the background like, oh yeah happy new year guys oh, happy new year <laughs> oh no don't pick that up yet because I want the spirit heart as a full, just in case it's a, a weird thing that doesn't allow me to do both. But yeah, it, 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 it was an interesting thing. I kind of started it like ages ago. Like I just turned and said, look guys, like any of you doing anything for New Year's? I'm like, well, we were going to, and then we just don't really want to. And I turned and said, well, we've all got the time off, so why don't we use this... Uh... Not heal that. To, you know, all have a meet up and do something. So I invited everyone around to my place. We all had a good laugh. It was good fun. Stayed up way too late, even for a New Year's. And then woke up the next morning with my mate just sat there frying bacon for a bacon sandwich, saying, Mate, do you want one? I said, Have you gone to sleep? I went, nah. <laughs> but. It was hilarious. Now we'll just leave that room. Stop that room. I I I I really enjoyed it. It was nice, and it was nice to catch up with a lot of people because when a lot of us either live quite far away, well, not for like UK standards anyway, like far away for us, like you know, a few hours, but which is kind of funny when you really think about it. But it's not as simple as, uh, oh yeah, we'll just uh, fly <laughs> there. <laughs> oh cool, that's what that does. 
yeah, like a four-hour drive is something where, because with the way we live in the UK, that's that's a, that's a day trip. Like you, if you're going there, that's your entire day, four hours there, four hours back. Like you won't do it. But then um, I know in America, a lot of people will just like a hundred percent, yeah. They, they they will do that in a day and spend like four hours visiting someone. I'm like, what? Hmm. Go with hmm. Oh yeah, I guess with the glass shard, if I'm like at a small level of health, I'm slowly bleeding if I'm not at full health. Uh, to the shop, let's go. Um... Not really what I wanted to see. Or sub on this guy. Deal devil chance and all that. And we'll take it. But yeah. So yeah, this sort of a uh, camping stuff is something we used to do kind of before. You know, we all had lives and jobs as kids, so. I think we did it like every time I used to come back from uni and stuff and we'd all like, you know what, let's go and spend like a weekend somewhere, chill out, relax. And basically a mate of mine just finds these places that we can do this and spend the time doing there, which is always great fun. So like, I ain't gonna worry about it, you know. Guess we're on a timer. Have I found the item room? No, I have not. So let's go do that first. There it is. The little baggy is appeared. And we'll just blow you up. Money. Let us go. I should heal, but the extra bonuses I get from this... Yeah, definitely now. Heal up now so we don't take that damage. Oh. Screw. We'll go in here. I will take that. I could get the conjoined transformation, but I think it's a little bit too much there. So let's drop down. Now we have a rotten baby as well. We're getting all the good babies. I mean, I could have gone for multi-dimensional baby, but nah, that's kind of like not worth it. Not with the health total I currently have and how prone I am to actually like taking damage. We'll stop that there. Is this room worth it? Maybe. Uh, ah, darn it. So yeah, I mean, for those of you out there that got friends you either don't see that often, or maybe you should see them more often than you do, um, plan something like that, where it's just like a day a year that you guys end up meeting up, and start it as early as possible, I would say, because you kind of keep it going as you get older, and it is kind of important to do that. The heart, let's pick it up. Because, like, once you start that sort of habit up, it becomes very difficult for people to break it as well. Especially if you're good friends, like... Really? Like, breaking a habit that you've been doing for, like, the past... ...so many years becomes... ...a very difficult thing to stop doing. <laughs> We are on a time clock with our health, but that's fine. I do not mind that. I can always just uh, use my healing to uh, sustain me if I need to. We don't have to... Ah, oh, we do have to worry about that. Okay, let's heal that. But 
That is not bad. Bad breath. I'll take that. Gives me at least a bit of an aura effect that I can use to poison people. But yeah, it, it's it's one of the things. Once you start something, it takes it, it's kind of like not impossible to stop. And I say it to a lot of people, where it's just like it becomes difficult for you to maintain relationships if you're not willing to put an effort the effort in to try and do so. At the same time, it's like don't put in effort if it's something where you don't get the same response back. Yeah, but food is great. So we'll pick that up and move on. For guys, it's a lot easier. For women, it's more difficult in the sense that you'll be surrounded by many people that you consider friends, but in some cases can be not as friendly as they first appear. Like, it's not unheard of in female friend groups for that to happen. Probably not as bad as it was before, but still can be very treacherous in situation. Like, I used to make the joke that... Um, <laughs> That whenever I used to see uh, women friend groups, they didn't seem like they grew up past teenagers. Um, but that's more the bickering and the stuff with the... Uh... Oh, that was terrible. Yeah, we don't need to worry about this room, to be honest. Oh, we do need to worry about this room if I want to clear it. Yeah, just let Daddy Long Legs do the work. Got no issue with that. And my flies. Here we go. Let's go in here. The Empress. Not bad. X Lax, interesting. Let's play your game. I don't want coins, I want to the heart, but you know. Oh, thank you. We'll play this guy for a little bit. Oh, you're going to play yourself up. Fair enough. I've got 16 bombs. Is this guy going to give anything good? <gasps> you did! Scatter bombs, I'll take that. I will come back for you, Dark Bum. Like, what, as soon as I find a heart somewhere. Actually, no, I should get one off when I um, feed him, right? Spirit of the Night. <laughs> now let's run, try and find a heart. <laughs> But yeah, it, like as an adult, maintaining relationships becomes really important in my opinion, and you kind of need to know on what relationships are going to be ones you want to maintain and ones that you don't. It seems very transactional, but to be honest, at this point, like between everything that everyone wants to do and have the enjoyment, I find like. The basic person, the normal person that exists everywhere else in the world, you tend to find that you don't have enough time, in some cases, to deal with everything that comes your way. I should have saved my money for the shop, but you know, all strength. So you end up having to make decisions anyway, based upon like the things you want to get out of. Take that. And in some cases, like it can be better for or for worse in most cases anyway. Like there, there, there's no good or bad choices and stuff like that. It's just ones that you gotta do that you make think so. You know, do I enjoy spending time with these people? If not, then don't bother. If you do, then great, you know? It is it's as simple as that. <laughs> Idiot. 
Oh, I mean me. But yeah, I mean, it can be difficult to kind of make the decisions. And then between that, you get to a point sometimes where it's just like, uh, I, d I don't really have any other friends or I don't have any people I can hang out with. So I don't really want to just like write everything off with some people. And I'm like, is it because of the fact you've got no one else to spend to, or is it because your self worth is tied to having people that you know class as friends at that point, you know? Like, my, 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 my self worth is measured by if I'm happy or not. And if I'm happy, that's all I care about. And funny enough, like, I don't need my validation on knowing if I'm happy from other people, which I think is a hard thing to get yourself away from. Like, it really is, because you're always trained to people please, even at a young age, you know, make mum and dad proud, make other people happy, you know, make yourself look good in front of teachers, those sort of things. Like, it doesn't seem that bad to begin with. Just go out and back in. Temperance is bad, actually. Set that down. Hangman is completely pointless. Ouch. That really threw bombs across there. I pick up the heart piece. Which is a sad thing to think about, really. That in all our lives, doesn't matter how far we get away with it, we're always trained to people please and make other people happy rather than ourselves, you know? I mean, if you can get away from it, it's uh, a lot easier. In most cases, like, especially parents, they just want you to be happy, so trying to please them won't do anything unless you just make yourself happy first. I say most, because, you know, there are exceptions to every rule. I'm never going to say there isn't. I wish there wasn't in some cases, but... Oh yeah, I could use my card, haven't I? I took it in this boss fight for this particular reason. We'll heal up here, we'll take the HP and move on. Yeah, that's kind of what I do in my day-to-day -day life. Like, I focus on me. I'm more important than most of the things that are going to end up happening, so... I shouldn't need to worry about other stuff, you know? If I have to sit there and worry about other things, then chances are that's more of a hindrance to me than it is actually a help, you know? And if there's stuff that I need help with, then I should have people that I can rely on to help me with them. If I don't, then technically they aren't real people that I should be relying on in the first place, right? But again, it can be hard to distinguish on particulars when it comes to stuff like that, you know? Nobody's perfect at the end of the day. We all make mistakes. I'm the first place to give people opportunities and chances. It does mean the fact that uh, some people do take the mick a little bit. But, you know, you can't get away from stuff like that. I forgot I had Dark Bun. <laughs> I mean, Little Brimmy. <laughs> you know, when you're having such a good run, you forgot you even have Little Brimstone. It's been nice. I've need, been needing one of these runs for a while, to be honest. Um... That was an enemy I haven't seen, so it's been released since like the newer updates and stuff. I was like, what? <laughs> but yeah, the main thing I want to do with the Isaac runs was actually just learn all the stuff that I've missed out on, you know? Because there's so much this game that, um, that I, I kind of got through a good percentage of it like ages ago and then kind of never came back to it after a while. Because there was just no need. Like, I'd done, like, the 
thousand percent on it way back then, and that was it. So I forget how old this game is, but it isn't like a new game, so it's been out for ages, you know. Ooh, a library. Item generator, we'll take that. Battery. Key. And a pill. Yeah, that's fine. I got enough shot speed in that from other stuff that it's not going to make much of a difference. But yeah, I'm, I, I'm a warrior. I worry about way too many things across the course of most stuff, so after a while I just kind of learn to not worry. Because, like, when it comes down to it, like, who's more important with, um, most things? It says you, you are. That's all that matters. Stapler. More damage. Nice. You know what, game? You, you could have divided my damage up a little bit, you know? And gave it to me the other runs when I needed it. Yeah, we'll waste money in this thing. Crystal ball will be pretty good. Spirit hearts are also fine. Decent cards. Would also be nice. Or the Emperor. Could use that straight away, actually. Nah, no coins. And yeah, we'll just use the Emperor card. But yeah, I, I, I've, I've always enjoyed spending time, and I, I, I'm a bit of a people watcher, like 100%, like I know I am, you know? It's pretty much all I end up doing in some cases. Studying people, watch what they do, how they react. can kind of make me good at uh, judging particular situations when they don't involve me personally, and I'm poor at my own advice. <laughs> As we all are, right? Ipecac. There we go. At least that's another win on the board, and a win for Maggie as well. So yeah, there we go. Nice easy run, a nice thing ticked off the list. Finally a win after many losses for a while. But again, if you do enjoy these videos, do leave a like, subscribe to see more, and I'll see you all in the next one. Take care.